I feel like all property owners are custodians of their land for such a limited period of time. And so I feel a, some sort of a moral obligation or responsibility to leave the land in a condition that's better than it was when I first got it. My name is Chris and my partner and I moved to the beautiful Pine Mountain four years ago. I've always wanted to live in nature, but I really wanted to create an environment where the wildlife is welcomed into my space rather than me feeling like I'm invading their space. And that's why we specifically looked for a block that was quite degraded and needed restoration. This property was originally covered in a really dry, thick type of rainforest called vine scrub. In the late 1800s, it was completely cleared of its original vegetation. And since that time, it's been invaded by weeds. So what I'm doing is removing those weeds and replacing them with the original vegetation that would have once been here. I've been collecting seed from the surrounding area and propagating them in a nursery and then planting them back out. I've also been installing a range of nest boxes to provide homes for a native wildlife. I think it's important that more people get involved in land restoration because weed control is a community effort. So what I recommend people do when they're first starting out is break up your property into smaller units that are manageable and not overwhelming and only expand that area once you've got that under control. I just hope that my story inspires others to give land restoration a go on their property.